So here we are with the match. I'm glad I made it in time as NJ's NP is using a team that um, saw some usage last OT. I think lefties and Black Oblivion used this team. And dude, I swear I built a team that looks exactly like Axel's team. I only had one more difference. I think I had something over the Heatran, but I swear the other five months were exactly the same and I built that team in Auras myself. So yeah, this is RSO USB week 3. My internet uh, on my computer just died a few minutes ago. I'm glad that I didn't miss uh, the start. Padlob has something to do. He can maybe join me in 10 minutes if the game is still going on. So yeah, NJP is on Cryonicles. Axel is on the Indie Scooters. Blunder said, I think Axel 10 is gonna lose. LOL. Hey, we are on the chat. NJMP asked lefties for the page right after the old T game, I remember. I'm not sure if they're like trolling or if they're like messing around. I guess that's, impos that's a good possibility. I mean, this team is like even more scary because Dr. You got an attack boost and Sun and Moon. This man is looking like a threat to NJMP if. I don't know if the Clefable is Spadef Unaware. If it's a uh, Fist Death Unaware, this man if he looks like a thread. But oh never mind, I just said there's an attack boost for Dark Trio. They are playing Auras, they're not playing Sun and Moon. Just forget what I said. <laughs> but yeah, this this will be interesting. Like I was about to say is this like Hydro Vortex Manaphy, but it's obviously like leftovers manaphies, I would assume. Unless Excel Ten is running some subsa like heat. But yeah, if you can scald burn the Clefable, that would be pretty nice for Axel as NJMP goes to Letty. Ah yeah, this is Mega Letty on the team. I think it's Bolt Beam. No, no, it's a Reflect type. It's Reflect type, Call Mine, Start Power, Roost, I think. I remember this team from OT, yeah. Um, I mean, NJMP can obviously, uh, he might have changed up some sets. What does Axel even have for this laddie? Doesn't this laddie just destroy him? He might have Toxic on Heatrim, but that's like the only... There's a Dougie in the back, that's the thing. Yeah, I don't see how Axel beats this. He just commands and then Reflect types. Oh, he just reflect, reflect types immediately, same thing. I guess now he's Bug and Steel, so the Heatrim... He turns Buck and Steel, but he kind of lures Axel to bring out the Heatran that way. And if he can bring out the Duggy on the Heatran on like a double switch, that's gonna be like really bad for Axel. But yeah, Axel U turns there in case NJMP tries to like double into Duggy. There's like no reason to make that play, but just in case. And I mean, the Scissor cannot touch this uh, as when it's Buck type. But is he like forced? Isn't he like forced to go into his? Tren. Uh, I guess he can go into um, into his own laddie if he has HP fire. <laughs> ABR doesn't the 6 0. <laughs> actually, yeah, Heatran can touch it. Because if, yeah, that's actually true. If Heatran comes out, he cannot even toxic it because he just reflect types again. So, yeah. I guess he can bluff HP fire. Yeah, he, he might have HP fire, but. If NJMP plays this smart, I'm pretty sure he wins this. <laughs> um, I think NJMP will like scout for HP fire here. Like, there's no way NJMP can risk his laddy. That's his super win con. Like, he just wins with his laddy. Why would he risk this? He can go to Clef or he can go to um Skarmory or Heatran. Depending on the Skarm. If it's like Spadev that might be a switching, but I think the Skarm is Fist Dev. Diancy is kind of annoying to this team looking at it, but 
So that's why I'm thinking it might be Spadef's gone, but Clefable checks Diancy pretty well. And Heatran also checks Diancy if it has Flash Cannon, but I don't think it has Flash Cannon on this team. Oh yeah, I think it's actually Scarftran on this team if I remember correctly. It's like Scarf Lava Bloom, Lefty's loves to run that set. Yeah, NJMP thinking hard about this play. Oh, Axel. They, like, they both took their time. Axel's time I went down to 150. And NJMP is at 150 now, too. Yeah, I, like, I knew NJMP wouldn't stay and then Axel actually has HP for He didn't just bluff it, he actually has it, okay? LOL, Blunder said this is a second grade bluff, stay in NCM. <laughs> HP Fire was gonna bounce off. Dude, why would he risk that? I don't think HP Fire would bounce off. Yeah, he could have roosted, but what if he got crit? No point in risking anything if you end JMP. So Axel is gonna go into Manif um, Among Us, I would assume. This is like Wish Protect Heal Bulb Moonblast Clef, I think. NJMP might double switch, but he kinda needs to stay in to get lefties and to get his Clefable healthy. Yeah, exactly, he stays in to get lefties. Throw the Wish in the air. And he can just go back. Now he, he might not want to put the Luddy to sleep because the Luddy is the win con. He might just go Suicune, put that to sleep, or Skarmory, depending on what he thinks is more useless. Yeah, he goes uh, Suicune. I can get behind that play for sure. So yeah, they're posting like a calc in the chat and they said, they say, um, and then P could have CM'd and just won the game, but there's no point in risking that, I don't know. What if it's like, what if it was like Specs HP fire and NJMP got crit, like, get a Suicune burn, a turn of sleep, and ooh, fishing for the burn gets it. I mean, this is kind of huge, but NJMP has heal but on his Clefable, so it's not as huge as you might think, as he can just go for Ruth. And... Scissor's gonna go for U-turn, and if NJMP stays in Reflect Typing, he will lose health, because he's burned, so... This is not Sun and Moon, so Burn is doing 12%, he goes Tren. Okay, I thought he would go uh, Skarmory, or Tren, something like that. It, this is Scarf Tren, um... Axel 10 can just bring out his Manaphy, or if he has Earthquake, he can bring out his Laddie. Um, I assume he will go like Manaphy and then double out, predicting the Clef, so NJMP cannot get off an Heal Bell. A Heal Bell, not an Heal Bell. He goes Landris, that also makes kind of sense. So I assume he's Scarf Lando if he brings this out, because his Heatran might be Scarf HPIs, and he wouldn't, he wouldn't want, he wouldn't bring out the defensive Lando. NJMP might also have changed up the trend set, but we don't see leftovers, so I assume it's Scarf. Goes into Scarm on what I predict to be a U turn, yes, exactly, gets a crit. As it's <laughs> a jack button Skarmory. <laughs> oh, yeah, that's the trap. That's the trap. Uh, I think it's the trap to run a type of Dougie. You bring in Skarmory, you get a jack button in the Dougie. And then Laddie just cleans up the opposing team when I have a Tita. So yeah, he jackpots into the clef, knowing the Lando is locked into the U-turn, and he just gets a free heal bell here. Pretty interesting. I mean, this team's like... I like this team, but it's probably not that fun to play against. <laughs> I don't... I wouldn't want to be in Axel's position right now. Let me actually check if my dude came back. Oh yeah, he's, he's, he's here. Can I call him? Axel's still thinking what he's gonna bring out. Oh 
I'm just gonna call him, my computer's gonna lay. Don't wanna keep Discord open and chat with him because that kinda ruins the recording. So, um, yeah, NJP's going for heal with 100% here. It's, yeah, yeah, it's, it's. it's still 6 versus 6, so yeah. Did you join yet? I joined, I joined. NJMP just went for heal though. Yeah, that was obvious. Wakes up the 3, going gets rid of the burn on the, the laddie. The laddie is like the win con, so that makes sense. And NJMP. NGMP is using like some really fat balance. Yeah, this is Lefty's team. Lefty's used as an ulti. Like, yeah. um, ABR said in the chat, he remembered that NGMP asked Lefty's for the pace bin. But oh, I'm, yeah. I'm not sure if he was trolling him or if that was true. Um, this is like, this is Rock's trend, but he, I don't think he can go for Rock's because if he goes hard into Dougie, yeah, nah, NGMP. NJMP. Actually, Axel, Axel, Axel could go for rocks, but I think NJMP will just take advantage of that. I think NJMP can just go into Lady or Suikun. I think Dougie would be a play if he considers um, Axel rocking. I think thing him to stay in. I think Lady just wins because Heatran cannot toxic it. He reflect types. He cannot get toxic because he uh, turns into Steel yeah. type. So I don't really see how Axel can win this. Um, yeah, I don't, I don't either. But it's still gonna be interesting. Like, this is gonna be a long game, maybe like 30 minutes. Especially because they're taking their time. Yeah, I don't know why he's thinking so hard. He can go um, into Suikun or he can go into Laddie. I guess he predicted. Oh, what? That didn't work out for Axel 10. He might go for Scarf Earth Power here. So, if I'm Axel 10, I might go into Laddy, predicting Earth Power. Yeah, he goes Laddy, I get that play. Ooh, NJMP goes for Scarf Toxic and misses. Why is the chat saying when you win? Like, chill. That didn't like. I don't think that's like game deciding. It's just a one turn lost. Let me restart the call. So is this Laddie just does it, does it have earthquake or he just goes for serve? That makes sense. It was like. I think this Camry has some spadev because that took the surf kind of well. Yeah. Problem. Problem is though, what if it, what if Axel is? Because I think Tebow coverage isn't that okay. Never mind. I I I wanted to say that Tebow coverage isn't that unlikely. That electric coverage on it isn't that unlikely. So. Now he has surf, HP, fire. Um, probably Draco. Oh. And then he has either okay. Roost or something else. Do yeah, if he's if he's if he's um or if he already showed HP Fire and, and uh, Draco, I I, di I didn't catch these turns. Yeah, the the um, oh he yeah, doubled then, into Dougie. No, but that that yeah, that's actually not. That's actually good play uh, from uh, for um or for Maxwell, just going into Among Us get he just he just gets a free spore off. Yeah, but he can just put the Suicune in his leap again. Yeah, I guess so. Axel doesn't really gain anything from doing this. Oh. I mean, that's... Crit. Oh, crit. <laughs> uh, he might just go for rest. Oh, and now he can just go for Scald. Or Calm Mind if he has... Does this have Calm Mind? Or is it like that, that Tally Special, Toxic Suicune? Okay, it's Calm Mind. Yeah, okay, so now he can burn his leap turn because Among Us doesn't do shit to this unless he crits again. Yeah, Giga Drain also doesn't have much many PP because Giga uh, Suicune has pressure. Yeah, I'm rendering this Uber's match in the background. Uh, so this is why my computer's kind of laggy at the moment. I think the call died again. 
But yeah, I can just narrate this myself, it's fine. I mean, I thought I matched from the beginning and Padlop didn't, so I know what's going on exactly, anyways. With Drew Suicune. <laughs> so he went on the Mana Fee on the Suicune. And he doesn't get the Skull Burn this time on the Laddie. So NJMP can attempt to go for a game. Uh, I'm wondering if this Mana Fee would have Ice Beam. He just goes for Coral Mine and he's gonna reflect type on the U-turn so he doesn't take damage. Like I he could switch out but then he just loses momentum. So reflect type makes more sense, yeah, exactly. What does he even have for this? Like he has to go into his own laddie now. I don't see what else he can do. Uh, maybe he has HP fire on Amongus, but that that wouldn't do shit. Nah, nah. Amongus is set up for that. He cannot clear smog either because it's steel type at the moment. Yeah, this is like over. I don't see how Axel wins at all. So I don't can just switch out into Clef or Heatran again. So the chat is saying I'd never not roost here. But why would you why would you risk getting critted? Yeah, exactly. Not everyone gonna avoid crits. <laughs> oh uh, Blanda said he's going to scissor predicting the, the clef here. I mean, I feel like NJMP uh, is pretty free to go clef, so going scissor kind of makes sense, yeah. But, um, if NJMP plays this like patiently, like, I don't see how he's losing. Did you die, dog? I didn't die, but the call was. I, I couldn't hear you for some reason. Oh. I mean, I, I could hear you. Mm. I, uh... Like, I'm pretty sure he's just going to clef here again. Um, I mean, if NJMP is real, he just stays in. Yeah, he can, but he has no reason to risk getting critted. Yeah, I guess so. But yeah, if Axel 10, like, oh, oh. he's going for game if he gets critted now. Dude, this wait, is so, wait, 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 hold up, hold so wait, risky. Wait, wait. Hold, hold up, hold up. Why, he has to roost why is he max speed? Why is he max speed though? Max speed, max HP, that's a set. It makes sense, uh -oh. dude. It makes sense. This lefty, the team lefty here. I, I thought, I thought, um, Megalotti always. God, the call's laggy. Yeah, that, that, that one max speed. I think even the bolt beam set runs max speed with, uh, with Thunder Wave. So um, if NJMP gets critted here, this will be like painful. And it gets critted, exactly. This is why I said you have no reason to risk this. Yeah, yeah. Dude, ABR, it, someone in the chat said, uh, ABR said, just stay in. And then they said, CB said, not everyone is lucky as you and can avoid crits. Right, yeah. I mean... This is like bad for NJMP because his team is in the bag one and three and really, really, this is really bad for NJMP, right? I think NJMP, this, this, this just turned from like a him winning to into an 06. <laughs> nah, nah, not, not, not like that. But um, it's, it's, it's turned, it's turned into a position where, where like Axel can actually win pretty easily. Like, the mana fees like. Not the biggest threat, but if he can scald, burn the, the unaware clef. I feel like the mana fee is going to be painful to deal with for NJNP. I mean... 
I get NJ and Peace play, but I was also like kinda impatient. So I think this the scissor doesn't have much attack investment, so NJMP was not scared of getting bullet punched there. I can just pass a wish into Suicune. Yeah, Suicune is pretty free here. Okay, Petlop is gonna switch over to Tablet, he's lagging. He passes the wish into Skarm that works too. Yeah, I don't know. Hmm. Healbell only has. Wow, he makes a nice double into Manaphy. Healbell only has a few PP. At this point, I think. He, NJMP doesn't have. He doesn't have enough Healbell PPs. Oh, yeah, true, true, true. This is like bad if he gets Skull Burned. Wait, what? Goes for Scarf Toxic again. This 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 is like really bad for NJP now. This if it's like, Rain Dance Manaphy, this is like really bad. Yeah, this is over. If it's Rain Dance, if it's Rain Dance Rest Manaphy, nah, Rain Dance Rest Manaphy then sweet the wallet play. Um, also the the laddie also dodged a toxic earlier from on Axel's side. Like if he didn't dodge that toxic, oh NJP would have been in a God. great position. Would you go for rocks here on the hard? I, I would consider doing it. If he goes hard doggy on rocks. That's, mm. No, then then that's still fine. He's probably gonna lava plume, I think. Yeah, probably. I guess there's a Suicune that can't come out. Yeah, the Suicune is pretty free for NJNP. So he predicts the doggy there. You can just U turn out and get some chip on the Skarm or on the Heatran. Oh, he pursued the god! And now NJMP cannot bring the Dougie in anymore on a heat run. Yeah. And he u turns, yeah. This is, this is, in, this is insane. This game, this game should be so over at this point. I don't know if NJMP choked or if... NJ, NJMP choked. Ah, he, he didn't he didn't choke really it was just I'm the like, fact that he had he brought a pretty passive team right i don't want to shit talk but he could have like easily switched out and not didn't have to risk that crit but yeah um he probably will explain he probably had a reason as to why he made that play he was probably just wanted because he wanted to sweep obviously yeah he wanted to go for game but i mean yeah, lucky players, I guess. I, NJP didn't really misplay. It was just I understand. It was just the fact that luck is a thing, right? I also understand that NJP might be frustrated because he missed a toxic on the laddy earlier, and then he maybe he got impatient. Yeah. So Axel gets a Brox now. NJP couldn't risk going hard, doggy, because the sash was already broken. Because the sash is already and broken. Axel can just go into laddy or Manaphy here. Those Letty. And he doesn't get burned. Yeah, this Letty would have been toxic if he didn't dodge earlier. I mean, I don't know if it would have made that big of a difference, to be honest, but. Um, maybe the Suicune can maybe still win Suicune some. Can win. Maybe the Suicune. Some. If you like. If the Manaphy doesn't have Rain Dance, the Suicune can win. Nah, even then. Only, only if it's like, um, Tail Glow, Rain Dance, Scald, and Energy Ball. Only then, um, NGMP just, just straight up loses. But other than that, I don't see NGMP losing. With, uh, so he's gonna go for a Wish here. Yeah. Obviously. And Axel will, Axel is gonna go to like, uh, Among Us or Scizor. Yeah. Or Heatran potentially. Oh, okay, never mind. <laughs> yeah, see, they're saying it in the chat. So we can can when we want Among Us because it has pressure. Yeah. Like NGMP, NGMP can still win, but the just just risking, just risking the luck. Um, I guess it was kind of. Um, eh. would he go like 
Is he going Skarmory here or? I think he the wishes again. I think he the Skarmory was a jack button. I don't think he can afford to lose leftovers. And the Skarmory already lost its item, it was a jack button. Yeah. Uh, I can see Axel doubling predicting the Skarm. Okay. I, I can see I can see NGMP doubling into uh, Dougie to be honest. So I would just knock again probably. I mean, Exla can just go to Laddy and get a roost off potentially. If he's roost, that is. Yeah. He could be default. Yeah, he doesn't have to be roost, bad. but... Because Lottie at this point kind of breaks NJPC. Mm. That's the thing with life orb, you get little, like you get worn down. Yeah. He might double again here on the clef. Or he might roost yeah, if yeah. he has it. I mean... He's kind of in a good position because he has rock sub and NGMP doesn't have rock, so he can double around. And he can just spread toxics and um, lava plumes just all over the place. So he's gonna go Suicune this time, I assume. Yeah. Or Heatran. Depends if X less. Uh, no, Heatran. If he predicts. Heatran, Heatran, he won't go. I'm pretty sure. Heatran, he won't go. Oh yeah, Heatran is pretty low, right? To Trans. Because then. Because then. Um, it would be yeah, at like 11 I thought and it, it, can, was that and it can switch in again. Yeah, I didn't know it was that low. I forgot. So, the Suicune is like pretty obvious now. Oh, okay, yes, Taunt too. So, yeah. As long, He's like Taunt, Toxic, as long uh, as, as long as Axel plays this well, right? Axel got this. Yeah. I think. I don't know if Axel could have won if he didn't get that crit. It would have been hard Axel for him. Definitely, a Axel definitely could not have won. Because store power, store power just literally went through his team. Yeah. Like for real. Okay, so that's the last time Heatran is coming in. He's probably gonna go for like... Earth power. Nah, I think he's gonna go for Lava Plume because he... Because Axel's uh, Heatran doesn't have off power in my opinion, and he will predict Axel will switch out. Uh, and uh, Flash Fire boosted Lava Plume will get a huge hit off on the Mana Fee or on something else. Like I would say, uh, Axel's last move is toxic. Mm, yeah, yeah. And if he's faster, if he's faster than Suchun as well. This is one hundred percent. Oh. Yeah, exactly. I I, yeah, they're just spamming. This is like World Cup, Party. Steve Angelo versus uh, Soul Wind, <laughs> where they both spammed Lava Plume and they got lefties back, I think. No, but uh, NJP is guard, so yeah. Yeah, wait, he sexed Dougie. Did he give up? So I guess he's, he's gonna go for game with Suikun now. It's like his last attempt yeah. to bring it back. But like, it just. Is it just one flash fire boost you get? Oh, and he's faster too. So he's max speed trend. That is, him to go for that, that's, that's skull so did game. nothing. That's no game. Skull did like, nothing too. There is zero a GMP can, can do. There is zero. This game is like over. Wait, right. how did that skull do nothing? Because he's fast trend. Is trend that bulky? I mean, Suicune is not that offensive of a, of a mon, I guess. ABR said I wouldn't really fault NJMP for risking it. Yeah. I mean, it's it's, it's just it's just a 6% chance, and it was like the second time he used HP fire, so I guess that's alright. To um, yeah, I agree with, I kind of agree with CBB, he didn't have to risk it, because he had multiple chances to crit, because NJMP had to, like, roost. Yeah, I guess so, but... I... I I wouldn't blame NGMP for, for 
risking it either. I wouldn't blame him for it. Of course, he could have played it better, but I don't blame him, per se. <laughs> Someone said he played a Dougie horribly, but I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna give my comment on that. I mean, the the, the Dougie, the Dougie just just got pursuit trapped and he just sacked it. So it's like I don't really know if he could could have played the Dougie better. Oh, okay, so um, the taunt was off and he can go for a rest now. Oh, it doesn't work. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Or calm mind, yeah. or calm mind if he's real. Yeah, come on, it's fine here. So I guess he has a slight hope to bring it back, but... Uh, Axel would have to choke at this point. Axel is like really solid, he also beat Trusco last week. Yes. Oh, okay, 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 okay. Sukun, Sukun can win. Sukun can actually Yeah, he, he, he goes for a rest now. He just goes, he just goes for rest. And yeah. I don't know. Axel played. I I would have I would have. Maybe he should have just stayed in with Tran. Yeah, so... I, I would have I would have even let that thing die to be honest. Like you have other things to check star. And like you, you go to mana, you go to mana right, and you just you, you just skull. Um, how can I make you love? After sacking Tran, right, and then you would like. Uh, win the game pretty easily, I guess. Plus, land okay. would be a thing, but not right. So, yeah, excellent. I would, I, time I would have sacked Tran at that point just to spam Taunt and Bob. Yeah, because if he sacks Tran, he can scare the Suicune out with Laddy after. Yeah. And if the Suicune switches out, it has to take rocks. Exactly. He doesn't have a haze mod either. Axel doesn't have a haze mod either, so Suicune can wait. I mean, he might be clear smog on Among oh, Us, but... Wait, 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 wait. Why, why did he even switch out? Um, because he wants to save the left. He's like, Suicune is his only way of winning. I mean... I think he needs the left to on Suicune. I mean, I mean, he really doesn't, right? I don't think he, kinda, he does. I mean, at least he gets rid of rocks, but... Rocks are just gonna go back up. But at, but at this point, I, w I would just go for like hard game, right? But you mean like, back to just, the Sugun? Just just um call mine, just call my dress, call my dress, and so on, just so you can sweep. I would go for that to be honest. Hmm. Suicune is like I've used Suicune and Oris, and I went like uh, forty three and four. Because like some match, some matches like I was in the back, but Suicune just brought it back. Yeah. I think I'm winning. Because because Suicune, Suicune is just it's just such a late, uh, such a, such a nice uh, late game Pokemon. Just call mines, just call mines on worn down Pokemon, and um, it just it just call mines and that just sweeps with Skull. Pretty much. Pressure is also pressure is also amazing. Yeah, for, for stalling, for stalling certain mons out, yeah. Like, Venusaur only has like, a few Giga Drain PP because of pressure. 12, 12. I think Giga Drain has 16 PP, so it only has 8. Wait, Giga... Okay, then then 8, yeah. I thought, I thought, um, that Giga Drain had 24, for some reason. Yeah, has 16. Yeah, but so NGMP can win this in theory at this point. Like I don't, Axel... I don't think. Uh... Oh, okay, NGMP is uh, ex explaining why he risked it. Okay. Yeah, I, I understand it. I understand it now. Yeah, yeah, see, see, now he gets knocked off, so he could have just stayed in earlier when he had a comb and uh... No, but, but I think... But no, now he but still now gets a... Now, now, now he gets a free calm forced. mind. Yeah. Yeah, I don't think the Manaphy has energy ball. I actually would have gone the Manaphy before if it had energy ball. Yeah, yeah. 
for sure. But I also forgot that the man is toxic. So it also plays a factor. Why didn't he comment again? Did he predict clear smoke? Oh, he predicted clear smoke. Okay. That makes sense. Um, not sure if he has enough skull PP to beat this Among Us. If he doesn't get the burn, it's gonna be rough. I don't know either. But yeah, I'm definitely not shit talking. I'm just interested to see how this will play out as he gets the burn on the second try. And he can just fire off a uh, call mine here. But not having leftovers is huge. I think that Among Us can't really solo um, the, the, the Suicune, but... Not anymore, because he got burned, yeah. No, why, why not anymore? Like, even even with... Um... Oh, the crit. The crit. <laughs> the, yeah. crit was, the crit was huge. Yeah, you're right. Among Us couldn't beat Suicune. Yeah, with it could sucks without, a lot. With or without, it, 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 it really couldn't solo. But Watch him crit, crit again. But with a crit, of course. Well... Couldn't he have stayed in? No. Actually, no, no, no yeah, never mind. Yeah, I don't think Axel 10 will allow him to rest, to let him rest again. That that was so huge, now it's probably over. Yeah, that, that crit was amazing. And JMP probably um, getting reminded of that Jamvet game last week. And at this point, at this point, Tramford pretty much solos. Yeah, it's over. Um, Unless it's uh, some random HP ground kill fable, but it's not. It already would you, revealed. Yeah, I, I, I would taunt you, right? I would taunt. Uh, I think he only burned one sleep turn, did he? No, he burned like a couple. Oh, he goes for nah, home he, and gets I'm it. Pretty sure, I'm pretty sure he only burned one sleep turn. I just checked, he only burned one. He said GG. <laughs> Sorry for all the luck. See, I told you, it turned from 6-0 into an 0-6. 6-0 into an 0-6. Sad, sad that that's actually true. <laughs> I mean that happens. Uh, Pokemon is like not competitive sometimes. <laughs> Finch better not win. What? <laughs> when is Finch playing? This game this week. Um, I gotta get uh, Finch and NJMP in the same video for that nice beef video. Just kidding, just kidding. But <laughs> that would be funny as fuck. Okay, so NJMP forfeits and. I can actually look at the score. The, the score is 1 and 4 now between the Cryonicles and the Indie Scooters. This was like pretty long, uh, 39 minutes. Yeah, it was it was a, it was a pretty long game because you know, NJMP brought this brought this bell. And also because they were thinking pretty hard. Um, at the beginning, Axel was thinking hard because he didn't really have a way of winning. Yeah, but then after um, the crit, it, 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 that I think. In the in the in the end or in the long run, it mattered so much. Yeah. I mean, MJNP explained why I didn't risk. Yeah, which is which is understandable, even more understandable in my eyes. But because if yeah, his, if his Clefable gets scored by man, if he needs his ice beam for the laddie, he just gets overwhelmed. That makes sense. But doesn't the sequence still wall the man if he has scored ice beam? I mean, if it has energy ball, definitely not. Yeah, if it has energy ball, but mm. uh, I, th I think it doesn't even want it if it has psychic, so it doesn't. Yeah. Um, thanks for Padlock for being on the video. I'm gonna end it here because it's already been almost 40 minutes. Uh, see you later with ABR with Flaming Victini. Doku signing out. Peace.